News at 5 continues. Before we go, we want to recap the latest on that mass shooting in Sutherland Springs that left 26 people dead. Let's go back out to Chris 6 News reporter Jane Caffrey, who's live from there. Jane. Well, Priscilla, there is still so much activity about around the First Baptist Church of Sutherland Springs. You can see that the entire block is closed off around the church as investigators continue working and trying to unveil some new information about this deadly rampage. And new this afternoon, the national media is reporting that the gunman's grandmother-in-law is among the dead. The gunman, Devin Patrick Kelly, had domestic problems, and authorities say he sent threatening text to his mother-in-law, a member of the church, not long before this largest church shooting in U.S. history. At press conferences earlier today, authorities explained that Kelly had purchased the fi four firearms. And again, this entire area is closed off. Now, this small town is being overwhelmed with law enforcement, but also supporters from nearby communities who are just here to lay flowers and pay their respect to the victims. There is a new briefing tonight at 7 p.m., so we'll bring you more information as this story unfolds. Reporting live, Jane Caffrey, Chris 6 News.